Is Apex dying or dead? Apex isn't dying or dead. It's definitely hit a plateau. Let's see if we can do something here. Okay, so. Apex's popularity is as shows. So. With this representing time and this representing popularity, right? So. Game comes out. We're fucking up here. Okay. Apex is out. Apex is out. You know, things are going well. Things are going well. Moderate plateau. Hype of the game. Whoops. Things are going well. Things are going well. Hype of the game kind of plateaus a little bit. And then, you know, something like this, I'd say. No, but a general downturn leading into like season six. And then like season four and five, it was like really bad. And then like, you know, an update would come out with a bounce and then to go down a little bit more and a moderate bounce for a preseason update. And then right around season six, season six was when we were like bottomed out. We're like down here. But then the rebuild started to happen in terms of popularity and, you know, then it was like something like this with updates, like something changed. Then there was a, like a really big point, like with Apex getting to like here, around like season 13, like the, the split everybody really enjoyed. And now we're kind of going back to like one of these. But like this range right here, this area right here is like a very, I guess to bring this full circle of stocks, it's a very, very, very resistance, like a very, very, very strong resistance area for the game. For the game to break past this area right here, this area right here, we need to be doing something else in the game. Whether that be team skins, going all in an esports a little bit more, but this area right here, which is significantly lower than like where the game was at at its peak right when it came out, but this area right here is where we need to penetrate. So why don't they do those things? Well, it's hard to quantify. It's a lot easier for me to say to do stuff to be better. But I mean, the easiest way for the game to gain more popularity would be having a tab right here called ALGS that shows you the land placements, all of the teams. You can select your favorite team. You can buy a skin for your favorite team. And uh, another tab right here called ranked. And you click the ranked and it gives you an in-depth leaderboard of everybody who's been playing ranked in every class, including your own. So if I'm in Platinum 3, I can see I'm ranked 9,000 in the game and see the RP about the people next to me. And then you can click people's individual names and see their top 10 most recent matches. You know what I mean? I feel like that's like kind of the thing we need to take the game to the next level. You feel me on that one?